Happening now in Fargo, it's Boo and NDSU, a chance for early trick or treating, some family friendly fun. It's where you find Dolly News Team Sydney's at tonight. Sydney, how's it going out there? Hi, Justin. A lot of excitement here tonight at one of the residence halls at NDSU. I'm seeing a whole lot of Elsas tonight. Just saw a Dorothy, a lot of superheroes, just saw a dinosaur. Now, it's all fun here at the residence hall, but remember, if whether you're trick-or-treating out in a residence hall or a building or outside, it's all about safety. Now, Fargo Police tell us here at Valley News Live that if you're going outside, make sure you make yourself visible, whether that's a glow stick or a flashlight. Visibility is a huge thing, right? The sun goes down, it's going to get dark. That's when people like to go out and trick or treat. And, uh, you know, having um, costumes that are, you know, visible, or if you can, mark them a little bit with some, you know, reflective material. So that way, when you are crossing streets and doing different things, and we all know how uh, kids get excited about Halloween and they want to catch up with their friends and maybe run across the street to, to their friend's house or to meet up at another house. And having those uh, those costumes, you know, visible, visible, or you know, for um, um, motor vehicleists to be able to to see the kids. There's a whole lot of activities happening here. A lot of different student organizations here having different tables, and you can also go up on the floors at the residence hall and trick or treat. Now this event goes until 7:30. Justin, I'm sending it back to you. Sounds good, thanks, Cindy.